Begin by positioning the shoulder such that it is in slight elevation and shift it posteriorly. Maintain this position while applying two strips of rigid tape to fan over the AC joint. The tape is applied anterior to posterior. For an anterior dislocation, position the arm in abduction and external rotation as shown. Begin by applying the tape over the mid triceps belly. If the patient is a chronic dislocator, you may choose to start a little bit higher. Now wind the tape underneath the arm and around the anterior shoulder to meet the pectoral muscles. Be mindful of underarm hair as this can make the process rather unpleasant. Continue by applying a few more strips in a similar manner so as to cover the entire anterior capsule. The patient is to maintain position throughout this entire process. You may also choose to reposition the arm with the hand on the hip, the elbow in line with the trunk and the humerus in slight elevation to begin providing stability to the posterior capsule. In the same way as the previous instance, the tape is applied distal to proximal over the posterior capsule. Two strips are placed proximally and distally to stabilize the tape afterwards. The proximal strips are applied anterior to posterior as shown and the distal strips are gently applied with the patient actively contracting the biceps muscle to prevent discomfort. Finally, the tape is anchored off at the pecs and at the shoulder blade. When the patient is taken to the position of dislocation, the tape resists further movement. If the patient is very unstable, you may choose to apply more strips anteriorly. This offers extra support for the patient. You may also choose to apply a few more strips posteriorly into the capsule.